Part 1. Think. Let the game begin. Being the best rapper, something that is, has, and will always be debatable because it is something that is, has, and will always be based on many opinions of those who listen and judge the art form. However, being the most successful rapper is something that can never be up for debate because facts are indisputable. But regardless of any opinion that a person may have about a player or a team, one's opinion cannot change the facts that are written in sports almanacs. And the names listed in such books are recorded for a story that only history could tell. Your success as a rapper, in more ways than one, similar to being successful in sports. Just as one good player cannot win a championship without the help of his teammates, you will not be able to reach your highest level of success in the music business without the help of a good team. And just as it may seem to take a sports franchise several seasons of trading for better players, your team may not be a championship team on the first go-round. It is possible that you may have to replace some players on your team if they're not playing the capacity. However, building a championship team is something that takes time. In the end, your starting lineup will consist of the following. The artist, the manager, the sound man, the beat maker or producer, the ghostwriter, the DJ, the video director, the computer whiz, the fan club, and the attorney. As the artist, you will be the leader and the captain of your team. The success of your team will not only depend on your creativity and talent, but also on the respect that the rest of the team has for you. Always remember that attitude reflects leadership, and how well your team does their jobs depend on how well you inspire them to do so. A manager. Although you'll be acting like a label and thinking like a manager, you'll need someone to take care of your day-to-day task of running your business. Some of the things that the personal manager will need to know include booking shows, negotiating contracts, and hiring other members of the team that you'll need as time goes on. The manager will be the middleman between you and others in the business, speaking on your behalf on many occasions. Communication between you and that person must be clear. The sound man. Now, it is a good idea to have a person on your team who is responsible for making sure all your music lives up to its professional standards. In other words, someone to make sure everything sounds good. The ears of your team doesn't necessarily have to be a recording engineer, but it would be smart to have someone who is familiar with recording studio equipment and recording software programs such as Pro Tools, Logic, or Cubase. Make sure this position isn't given to a yes man, but instead someone who has the ability to be honest and critical at all times. Now the beat maker is important. A good producer can help shape the signature sound. Ghostwriters, although it's considered taboo in hip hop to present someone else's rap as your own, some of the biggest names in the rap game have had help crafting their hit songs. It is a reality that many rap fans, young rappers, may not want to accept. But their refusal to accept it doesn't make it less of a reality. Ghostwriters can come in the form of hook singers or other rappers. DJs. Ultimately, you will want every DJ to play your record. And having a DJ on your home team can promote your music at parties always works to your advantage, especially if he's reputable. The video director. Finding a person that has the ability to create visual concept, go hand-in-hand with your music, can be in your best interest all the time. The computer whiz, although promoting your music online can be helpful, it can be time-consuming. Having someone that can run your fan base and blogs to your satisfaction will always have time to handle your business in the real world. That's priceless. Now the fan club. Think of it like this. No one likes to see a beautiful woman talking about how beautiful she is. It's a turn off. It makes people ignore her beauty. However, if a beautiful woman is modest and let other people speak of her beauty, then more people become attracted to her. The same goes for you and your music. You shouldn't want to be the only one participating in the conversation. People are more likely to want to see what all the hype is about when they hear other people singing your praises. That's just human nature. Now the attorney. 
There are several different type of lawyers. You will need an entertainment attorney that will understand the language that's in your contracts. It is important that the attorney on your team doesn't specialize in real estate law or some other type of legal practice. However, it may be a good idea to have a good criminal lawyer on deck. But again, attitude reflects leadership. And it is important to keep a positive attitude and set an example for the rest of your team. The attitudes of people on your team is what people will use to decide whether or not they will give you a chance. Every label executive, to DJs, to fans, will be more likely to support those that are polite and humble than they will people that are rude and arrogant. You can have all the talent in the world, but if you and the people on your team have attitudes, that's a turnoff to people. You can find yourself displaying all of your talent to an empty room.